time to learn more about your drinking water. Hi, I'm Ryan Greenfeld here with your next episode of BPUB Central. Every year, water providers are required to submit a drinking water quality report, also known as the Consumer Confidence Report, or CCR. This document provides a lot of insights into exactly what comes out of our taps. Here with us to shed some light on the CCR is Seshimani Vori from the Analytical Lab. Drinking water quality report, it's also called a CCR. What that means is consumer confidence report. As per EPA regulations, every year the water utility has to provide the consumer confidence report to all its consumers by July 1st. And what does the CCR have? It's like a report card given to the public utilities by the Texas Commission of Environmental Quality when you pass and do not have any exceedances and you follow all the standards set forth by the TCEQ and the EPA. And also it's like how when you read your food labeling, you get to know what is in your water. Similarly, consumer confidence report basically gives you or tells you how safe your water is and you can also read all the contaminants that have been tested. There's a lot of analytical work being done. For the last year, the BPUB analytical lab as well as the Department of State of Health conducts analytical testing on different parameters. To be specific, like more than 164 parameters and they're all formatted into a table and presented in the CCR. What you do is they, you have certain MCL and MCLG, which is listed in the CCR. What MCL means is the maximum contaminant level. So we do not want to exceed the maximum contaminant level. That's set forth by the EPA and TCQ. And the MCLG is the maximum contaminant level goal. We want to have the maximum contaminant level goal set. but. Even if we reach the goal, it's not really anything bad because it does not cause any harm or any bad health effect to the consumer. And also the CCR tells you about the source water, where are you getting the water from and what are the contaminants that are present in your source water. When you open your CCR, basically you have the information, the hotline number for the EPA. If you have any concerns, they also give a caution of notice for people with health conditions or immunocompromised uh, citizens to be careful. And then they also have these tables where all the analytical data about the source water and the different contaminants that have been tested for the water are provided. BPUB is recognized as the superior water quality system and you see the banners all posted on our water treatment plants. What that means, what being superior water quality system the stringent conditions set forth by the TCQ has to be followed in order to be recognized as a superior water system. And in order to continue to be recognized to be the superior water system, it has to be a continuous process. And BPUB does a real good job in acquiring the superior quality. Thanks to all the folks who helped put this report together and for all of those who helped produce the city's drinking water supply. If you'd like to learn more about the CCR, you can attend a meeting Wednesday, July 19th at the BPB boardroom. If you'd like to read the report for yourself, head over to the BPB website. The report is available in both English and Espanol. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next time.